On a warm summer evening, for many Bavarians, the beer garden is a must. Certainly that's true in Gershofen. And tonight, accompanying the salads and schnitzels, there's also political chat, because the local MP has dropped in to hear people's concerns. As this is election year, the Christian Social Union is taking no chances. We're here to speak to the voters, to persuade them that ours is the right way, that as a genuine people's party, we can govern Bavaria, that we can keep our society pulling together and not apart, and so our economy prospers and everyone can share in it. But that's the problem for his party. Traditionally, this parliament has been a stronghold for the CSU. In election after election since World War II, it seemed to have a stranglehold both on parliament and politics here. And yet, if the opinion polls are accurate, that grip may be slipping. Where once the CSU could count on winning almost half the votes, now that's fallen below 40%. Their nearest rivals are the centre-left Green Party, with the Social Democrats a few points back in third place, and the far-right anti-immigrant AFD close behind. Some people blame this man for the CSU's present predicament. Horst Seehofer, federal interior minister and long-time party leader. His plan for tougher border controls and an accelerated program of deporting failed asylum seekers pleases the far right, but it's also galvanized the left and center left in opposition. And some analysts say some of Seehofer's ideas seem to be a serious threat to civil liberties. It is a very slippery slope in that sense that um, you gradually have uh, a degradation of, of the rule of law and of human rights because if you look, for instance, at the um, media coverage of migrants and especially more right-wing media, you see that you have, they don't see migrants as humans anymore, they see them as an issue. Such thoughts seem quite distant in sunny Gershofen. The CSU insists instead it's based on humanitarian pragmatic policies. But as October's election draws nearer, perhaps that pragmatism may well be tested. Dominic Kane, Al Jazeera, in Bavaria.